um, you know, um, you know, we just heard this 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 point about untrustworthy people. And we yes, George Soros is evil, but not stupid. His son, Alex, seems to be both stupid and evil. I was with Klaus Schwab this winter. I was you were with Klaus Schwab. Um, you know, um, you know, we just heard this 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 point about untrustworthy people, and we talked about things in the United States like you know, like um, checks and balances, which aren't written anywhere, but are customs. And one man, Donald Trump, literally came in and just took that you know took that took that all away. Um, you know, so. Um, you know, so, um, you know, but when I see this, you know, when I look at this, um, you know, um, you know, uh, more globally regarding, regarding, you know, regarding democracy, I also say to myself, when was this great time that everybody got along so well and, you know, things were going so, so great? I mean, I think, you know, um, um, you know, the, um, you know, I think that we really have to be careful here in you know in this nostalgia uh for a time uh you know for a time past because a lot of the reactions we're seeing in society are actually reactions to positive uh to positive things like you know like equality uh for women um you know uh and um uh you know and greater diversity uh which come with backlash Yes, this is insane. There is something more interesting which I'm going to show you. I think we talk a cousin, but before I do that, this guy did something recently on X, and a lot of people are furious. Democrats should refer to Trump as a convicted felon at every opportunity. Repetition is a key to a successful message, and we want people to wrestle with the notion of hiring a convicted felon for the most important job in the country. So you can understand exactly what they are doing. This is Alex Soros sending this out at the World Economic Forum. We saw what he did, what he said about Trump. Now coming to do this, very concerning. Dr. Carson had or met with Klaus Schaub. He saw something. I'm going to play this so you can see exactly what is going on. If you have not subscribed to this channel, please endeavor us to do that. It will do you no harm. If you share out this clip, oh no, he stepped down. Club Schwab is still not there. Tucker Cash are meeting him. And what motivated the ruling class? He is like an elderly idiot who seems a little senile, doesn't have any idea what he's talking about. The closer you get, the more you realize the people running things are mediocre. That is Tucker Carson. There is something more concerning. I don't know. It should be maybe breaking news everywhere. How do we exploit the moment politically without giving the impression that this was the plan all along? <laughs> Republicans needed to employ a slightly different strategy. There is something more concerning. I don't know. It should be maybe breaking news everywhere. Review NATO plan to get U.S. troops to the front line to fight Russia. Alliance prepare for rapid development of American soldiers amid fears. Moscow is plotting major war with Europe. That is according to the Daily Mail. When you go down this article, you will clearly understand exactly what is happening here. NATO is drawing up plans to send American troops to the front lines of Europe in the event of all-out conflict with Russia. It has been reviewed. New land corridors have been carved out to quickly funnel soldiers through Central Europe without local bureaucratic impediment, allowing NATO forces to pounce in an instant shoot Putin devastating war in Ukraine move further west. The plans are said to include contingency in case of Russian bombardment, letting troops sweep into the Balkan via corridor in Italy, Greece, and Turkey, or toward Russia northern border. Mm? So this is what is going on. That is according to Daily Mail. If you want to reach, to actually understand exactly what is going on. You should be able to get to that. I think I will put the link on the descriptions. I decided to create an awareness so you will know what is happening. You might be sitting there not knowing your son is somewhere, you know, fighting. If they are to take up this decision, then the situation will be beyond control because it might escalate things to a level that we don't even know.
in your business. Uh, it's not for me to give you a lecture about that, but you should challenge some ideas. For instance, uh, you spent my life talking to people who run countries in various countries. It's a thing that people do when they get power. They abuse the shit out of it. Here's the illusion that we fall for time and again. We imagine that evil comes like fully advertised as 